While Connecticut's COVID numbers remain to be some of the best in the country right now, some cities and towns in our state are starting to see an uptick, especially among teenagers. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is live. He's with the mobile newsroom in uh, Cheshire for us right now in more details. Hi, Matt. Uh, hi there, Mark. Well, the health district that covers Cheshire, Prospect and Wolcott, they're reminding parents and kids that to keep everyone safe, they really need to be following those state guidelines. And that's because uh, when you look at the latest numbers here uh, of cases in Cheshire, the district says teens, young adults, they were more likely to have COVID when compared to any other age group. And in half the cases, because there were no symptoms, they didn't even know they had it. So what could be causing it? Well, the health district feels people likely let their guard down a bit. Contact tracing revealed some had positive family members, but others got infected after getting together with family and friends or attending sporting events. Now, cities, towns, school districts all over the state say they knew they'd see some positive cases as kids headed back to school this fall, but they don't want this to spiral. So they're asking parents to remind their kids to wear those masks, keep that six feet of social distance, and avoid any large groups or gatherings. And soon we spoke with today well they tell us they're trying to do their part i played football here uh you know our season got canceled and uh you know we're, we don't really want any of the other sports to get canceled so we're doing everything we can to make sure everyone else is uh safe and nothing else happens and it's not just the district here, it's happening uh, all across Connecticut. In fact, coming up tonight at 530, we'll hear from some folks uh, in another town that they actually had to close high school, a high school for two days this week after a number of cases in which they say were connected to a number of large gatherings over the weekend. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Cheshire. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.